All right, guys. So this is just this jig I was talking about right here earlier. You can see, you can see we got 22 right here, and this jig and with the steel saw right here. Just hold it tight on this end, and just run through your machine. Flip it, do the same operation on the other side, just like this, just like this, and do it again, cut it. Now we set it up on the table and I'll show you how we finish it. All right, now we have cut out the top or back or front, whatever you want to call it. And we're just gonna cut this, same thing I show you on the miters. And then we're pull out the panel and cut off a half inch of this to make it fit at 21. But first, let me finish this real quick. All right, guys, check it out. We're here making drawers. So we're just gonna modifying these drawers to 22s to a 21. We're taking an inch off right now. Basically what we're doing, just cutting the, the edges of it and cutting the panel underneath it. Just a half inch on the panel. And there we go. You see? That's all we're doing now. We'll put it together over here. Just a little bit, not enough, you know. Just enough to To glue it back on there. Now, I'm putting this piece right here. There it is. Now we're going to lay it down because we want this part to be flush right here. So we're going to get our staple gun, make it flush, and shoot it. And shoot it. <laughs> there we go. Just put out three of them. That way, one in the middle and two on the side, you know, just to get the support right there and make sure it's, it's flush right here. Now let's bring it to the other side. There we go. Make, bring it to the other side and then we're just gonna nail it here right here again make the part flush right here there we go another one in the middle and another one on the side not too much on the side right next to the one right there just to make the the support right there and then we got one ready again hey what's up guys welcome to Terminal Blogs we're here at the workshop we're installing some guides in this guides rails soft clothes and we're gonna show you how to do them real quick all right so check it check it out use the jig for the bit We have a uh, three-quarter 
We go through left and right. Don't tie them too much because otherwise you'll break the plastic here. So not too tight, all right? And it's always good to pre-drill because otherwise you end up with the with the broken filler where you're gonna put the screw. It happens all the time. You hit them pre-drill it. So now that that's done. We're gonna mark. We're gonna mark our guys on each side. We gotta be flush. This has to be flush with this, and then we just mark it. Same thing on this side. Here we go. So now that we have that already, we're gonna grab the multi-tool and cut these two edges, and. Cut this right here too. There we go. So that that's much space we're gonna we need, which is it's a one inch and a quarter that we need to take off in order to put our guide right here. So with the multi tool, we're just gonna cut it real quick. Battery right now. So we got a, another battery here at home. Oh, so there we go. to this top. So like this much only taking off, which is, is like half inch. We're pulling out in order to get these guides in there. So now, So you see it's flush now right here, same thing on this side. We got a little extra, which is... Just shave it off a little bit. So now that it's flush, flush, grew up, we grab our jig again. We're gonna flip it upside down. We're gonna grab our power tool here. And through this hole right here, that's where the measurement is. Just a little bit, not too much, you know, just enough to to make the, the hook. No, not just enough. So this can fit right here, the little hook. So now we just turn it around and let it slide in. And you see how down here is flush how we wanted it at the beginning. Now that one get, went in. That's where it has to be. This is just an adjustment. 
it goes up and down this one right here same thing down here this is adjustments right here only it goes up and down just to adjust the drawer so now we're gonna do this other side same process different side all right guys let's do this to make the, the hook get in there okay so now that that's done Easy guys. All right. I hope you you find some ideas, you know, for installing sub closing guides. So stay tuned for more. And thanks for watching. Subscribe to Torilla Blocks, and we'll see you soon. Peace. Be careful out there.